We are talking about the timeless Kajiva Mito, the eighth leader of the Sharana house, capable of revolutionizing not only the world of two wheels for the new centaurs with its lines, but also an era that marked and inspired thousands of young people. Planned by Massimo Tamburini, destined to supplant the generally fantastic Kajiva Frecchia C12R, the principal form of the Mito was introduced in 1990 at the GP of Countries in Misano Adriatico, at first in a stripped variant, strutting on the track drove by the authority riders of that one. Year of Mamola, Barros, and Haslam's caliber. The fared rendition, the conclusive one, showed up a couple of months after the fact. The 125 was a scale replica of the motorcycle that Randy Mamola drove in the 500 World Championship. It had 31 horsepower at 10,400 RPM, weighed about 120 kilograms, and cost about 6 million lire. It goes without saying that the round headlight model was hugely successful, for four years, it was Italy's best-selling bike. The Mito EV development showed up in 1994, which introduced numerous enhancements, with feel getting from the well-known Ducati 916, the model that impacted the world forever. It wasn't easy to replace a successful model like the previous Mito, which had been produced for four years and enjoyed great commercial success. Nevertheless, many fans fell in love with the new EV right away. Aprilia, Gilera and Honda have delivered phenomenal eighth of a liter and keeping in mind that Aprilia has leaned toward the lively picture and style Gilera the development and Honda Italia the substance. Kajiva with the Mito EV has attempted to think this large number of qualities in an ideal mix. In a solitary bike, with an elevated degree of value and meticulousness. In the 1990s, there was a real battle for market dominance between the Aprilia RS and the Kajiva Mito. Due to the success of these two motorcycles, the two manufacturers held a real debate about how to respond to motorcycle blows. On the Kajiva side, there was a bike that drove people crazy for its clean aesthetics and its big bike image, helped along by the replica colors of race bikes like the Lawson Replica and Lucky Strike. There was never a true winner because the two motorcycles had distinct characteristics, both of which were appreciated by enthusiasts. The seven-speed engine and seven-speed gearbox were unquestionably the stars of the show, but in reality, they were no better than a six-speed gearbox. On the other hand, the Aprilia part was a bike with a more street-style appearance and slightly more accommodating dimensions, even for taller boys. This also drew motivation from dashing, with reproduction Reggiani and Chesterfield tones. The feature was the lovely aluminum outline, shrewdly worked and with a twisted shape, significantly like that of dashing bicycles and in this way more refined than that of the Mito. Photo 3 Kajiva Aprilia.jpg Throughout the entire existence of street bicycles, nobody had made one eighth liter two-stroke bicycles so strong and delightful to ride with top gear, for example, Marzaki suspension and Brembo brakes, totally thorough in the bends and extremely quick on the straight. The 125 had become so outrageous that the unexpected losses of miners had never been higher, so in 1999 the law changed and constrained a power cutoff of 11 kilowatts, 15 horsepower, for all cruisers that can be ridden with an A1 permit feasible at the 16th. Date of birth. In the years that followed, sales of the weaker models began to decline and the power was nearly cut in half.